welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking at the Strymon Brigadier Deep Bucket Delay Pedal. Now the Brigadier is an authentic recreation of analog Bucket Brigade style delays. It features a selectable deep bucket chip that allows you to choose from short, medium, and long delays. The Strymon Brigadier was first released in 2010 as a mono pedal. Then, in 2012, based on customer feedback, Strymon introduced an updated Brigadier design that included an internal jumper allowing for a selectable TRS stereo input, as well as non-click foot switches. The core features. The Strymon Brigadier features three delay time modes, short, medium, and long. Three tap tempo modes for quarter, dotted eighth, and eighth note triplets. A bucket loss control knob to vary the amount of loss that occurs at each stage of the debucket, and a modulation knob. But, as with most Trimon pedals, if you look under the hood, you'll find a whole lot more. With the Brigadier, you also have an adjustable 3 dB boost or cut when the effect is engaged. An infinite repeats feature engaged by holding down the tap switch. A filter control for adjusting the tone of the delay repeats. A selectable trails mode if you like your delay sounds to spill over. And, for tone purists, the pedal works in either true bypass mode or a transparent analog buffered bypass. So why did I get a Brigadier pedal? I was looking for an always-on delay pedal that could sit in the background. Something kind of like this. But I was also looking for something that had a little more going on under the hood, just in case I needed more. The Brigadier seemed to fit the bill, and so here we are. So first off, I wanted to cover three cool things that I found using the pedal for just a few days. Number one, dirt mode. You can add a little grit to your delay sound just by turning up the time knob. Basically, when you turn the time knob up past three o'clock, you'll start getting delay artifacts, which is cool. So if you like the dirt, turn the time knob up, then use your tap tempo knob to set your delay time. to dark mode. Seems like everybody likes dark mode. The Strymon Brigadier allows you to darken up the delays, which will knock down some of that pristine Strymon tone and get you more of that vintage vibe. To switch to dark mode, just press the on and favorite switches at the same time, and then turn the bucket loss knob. Left is darker, right is brighter. <laughs> thing about the Strymon Brigadier is the infinite repeats feature. To engage the infinite repeats feature, just press and hold the tap switch. This can be a cool thing when you're looking to make a quick or long musical statement, depending on the situation. Alright, next up, song time. So here are my first impressions on the Strymon Brigadier. As usual with the folks from Strymon, it's a high quality sounding delay pedal. Number two, it's a simple and easy to use pedal. Just set the delay how you like it to sound and use the tap tempo to adjust the taste. Next up, it acts and responds just like an old analog pedal. This one's funky. 
The Brigadier is unpredictable like an analog delay. For example, I'll set up a tone and then switch to bypass. Then, when I engage the delay again, it seems like the delay settings are slightly off. A quick touch of a knob and I'm back in business. At least that's what it sounds like to me. I may be going crazy. I may be going crazy. Next up, having an analog delay makes you want to do that 80s U2 thing, which sometimes is good, sometimes is bad, and sometimes is ugly. This one's a toss-up when it comes to an analog pedal. But basically, the tap tempo knob flashes when you're in bypass mode. I keep looking down and thinking the pedal is on. I suppose when I'm on a dark stage somewhere, it'll help. But for now, in the studio, when I'm looking down, it's still a bit of a pain. But it is a cool feature to have in a live situation. And to end on a good note, the modulation knob is a nice touch. It gives you that memory man vibe that's much appreciated. All right, well, that's a wrap. Let me know in the comments below if you have any questions or requests on the Strymon Brigadier. Until next time, thanks for hanging out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video. Rocks out. Pew! <laughs>